Welcome to today's video and today we are talking about frequency. So how often should you hit a particular muscle group in a given week? So that's why I have prepared here a spreadsheet for you. And here I have outlined the major splits in my opinion that you could follow. So first of all, we have the three times full body per week. The standard is Monday, Wednesday, Friday. So here we aim for a three times per week frequency. Then the second split is an upper lower. It's a four day per week variation. So we have two upper days and to have two lower days. And this will give you a two times per week frequency. After that, we have the five days per week upper lower split. This is my recommendation when you are more advanced. So we have here three upper days on Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and the lower days are on Tuesday and Saturday. So here we have a mix. Some muscle groups will be hit two times per week, but other muscle groups will be hit three times per week. Then we have the push-pull legs split. So we have the double push-pull legs when you are doing push, pull, legs, and then you repeat without a rest day. Once again, push, pull, legs, and you only have one rest day in a week. So here we will be having a two times per week frequency. And then we have another push, pull, leg split where you take a rest day in between. So you have three days on, one day off. So you do push, pull, legs, rest, push, pull, legs, rest, and repeat. So this gives you a less than two times per week frequency. It's a bit less. So here you are hitting each muscle group two times per week, but in an eight day period. So you are transcending here the human understanding of seven days in a given week. You are training in eight days. So you think you are special here. Now I did test out all the splits over my lifetime of lifting. So I think I can give a pretty good answer. So after transitioning from my strength focused days, when I was heavy focused on increasing my bench press one rep max, I started in hypertrophy training with the three times per week full body split because I have discovered if you would be benching three times per week, then you get far better results compared to two times per week. So I did think I finally found a super hack here to excel in hypertrophy training. So the secret would be hitting each muscle group also three times per week. Now that's a very close minded and shallow way to think about your training. We have to look at the whole picture at all the factors that come into play if you want to make results while training for hypertrophy. So the other two main factors is your intensity. So you want to train as close as much to failure. And then you have factor number two, which is your volume. So how many hard sets are you doing in a given session and in a given week? Only then you have to look at frequency. So let's say we are training to failure or to zero reps in reserve, so very intensely in all the splits. And then we set a target volume for the week. Let's say we are training here the arms, so let's say the biceps, and we set the goal of 12 hard sets per week. And that's for all the splits. We want to hit 12 hard sets of biceps per week with high intensity. Now, what does it mean in a particular workout? How will we distribute these 12 hard sets over the week here? So here on the full body, we have three workouts per week. And we want to hit the magical three times per week frequency. So we are doing four sets each session. And that way we will reach our target of 12. Now in the upper lower split, for example, we also want to hit the 12 sets, but we have only two workouts available, two upper days. So then we will of course do six and six, for example. Then on the five day variation, we have here three upper days and two lower days. So we will train biceps on the upper days. So we have three times per week frequency and we will do four in the given session. Then we have the push pull legs with the two times per week frequency. So we have to do six sets per session. If you have not been following my channel, then you would put the biceps in your pull day. So you're doing back and biceps, 
but actually the small secret is if you want to get big arms you do biceps on the pushti so you do here six and six and same goes for the other push pull legs you will do here on pushti and then your weekly volume is equated you have 12 hard sets distributed here over each particular workout and if you compare now the person that will be on each of the split how much did they gain in the biceps in terms of muscle size you will find out it's the same on all the splits the difference is very minuscule because you have all things equated you have equal amounts of intensity so high intensity training to failure and then you have the hard sets here at 12. so the difference between hitting it two times per week and three times per week is almost not noticeable at all only if you are a beginner for example and you are not used to training your biceps you will maybe see better benefits in training it three times per week because you can practice on your technique a little bit better but if you are more advanced it makes no difference so you have to look at frequency in terms of convenience so first you choose the split that you enjoy that you can manage not all people can train the same amounts of days in the game week some of us have only three days available some of us can train four times per week and some of us can train even five times per week so you have to decide for yourself how many days are you willing to spend in the gym and then you distribute the hard sets over the workouts now when frequency comes into more importance is when you want to do more sets so let's say you have a particular muscle group where you want to hammer it with 18 hard sets per week and then it can be problematic if you are running a two times per week frequency so if you have only two training sessions you will then need to hit nine hard sets in a particular workout so here nine here also and then sooner or later you will realize that you are running in junk volume territory so that means the later sets are not effective and they are not contributing to your growth on the contrary they can be detrimental to your progress so in that scenario i can see the benefit of frequency training so here you can distribute then six hard sets in each of your workout and this is much more manageable you can do six hard sets in the workout and not go into this junk wall territory and then you will hit your desired goal of 18 hard sets but this is quite a rare scenario and it should be left only to a couple of muscle groups if they are really lagging or you really want to push them to the next level so at the end of the day you will be fine with three times per week frequency you will be fine with two times per week frequency you will be also fine with a two to three times per week frequency so you can hit some muscle groups two times per week and some muscle groups three times per week depends on your preference and you will be also fine on the last split if your frequency will be just below two times per week so you don't have to stress yourself out of hitting the magical two times per week frequency for example is in this double push pull leg split you can only achieve a two times per week frequency if you have one rest day per week but if you do the second variant where you have a rest day in between then you'll achieve a little bit less than two times per week frequency but then you have the added benefit of additional recovery time so at the end of the day better recovery with a less frequency i think will yield you better results so that's my opinion on frequency training for hypertrophy pick whatever split you can manage to perform long term and which you enjoy and then train to high intensity and distribute the volume as you see and don't worry about whether you are training the muscle two times per week or three times per week the difference is almost not noticeable and you can achieve great results on both if you are interested more in hypertrophy training check out this playlist right here and i will see you soon in the next videos bye